Hi, this is Hayley Atwell, and these are my firsts for Virgin Radio. First day on the set of Mission Impossible was in Norway, and I was stood on a platform with Simon Pegg, Tom Klementiev, Tarzan Davis, and we were watching Tom Cruise motorbike off a cliff without a helmet on. And the first time we saw it, we, we'd see him go over the cliff and we would listen on headphones to hear canopy, which had meant that the parachute had been deployed and was, he would made it to the ground. And we were just we were holding our breaths, going, please don't die, this is the, the please don't die, Tom, we miss you, we love you. And then also going like, and also this is the first, first day of the movie, like we've been pretty bad that it, if he, if <laughs> it ends before it's begun. The first one that I properly paid attention to was E.T. Probably on at Christmas one year. It seemed to be when I was a kid, it was on every Christmas. Uh, and it was such a cinematic experience. So uh, captivating and I, I it was so vividly stuck in my memory. First time I met Tom Cruise, I think it was a screen test for a job I didn't get. Uh, but look at me now. Uh, it, it was, yeah, years ago. And I remember he came in and he was so, uh, so genuinely kind and approachable and easy and had learned all the lines and was sat behind the camera, giving me just as much as if it was his close up. And I thought, what a cool guy. First gig I went to, age seven, the Glass Spider Tour, Dave and Bowie, Earl's Court. Got a badge. <laughs> First crush, Brad Pitt, 1993, A River Runs Through It. And I, I had, I was at, it was at UCI Whiteley's and I took the ticket stub home, stuck it on my wall. And then every day after was like a new picture of Brad up on my wall. My great love. First album I bought that I can remember, like pro proper album, was Miss Education of Lauryn Hill. First poster was Brad Pitt, obviously. Yeah, he was wearing a fish, fish hat, fisherman's hat with like fishing bait in it. <laughs> Cause he was in a river runs through it. And and I would kiss it every, and it was on my door and I'd kiss it before I go to bed every night. And I remember my mum's friend came over once and she looked at me and she looked at the poster and she went, you kind of look alike. So you having crush on him is not quite narcissistic. And I remember first of all going, I'm 11. I, 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 okay, all right. And then I was also really embarrassed because I do what? And then I was also like, I look like Brad Pitt. Like, oh, that's amazing. That's it. Like, wow. I, it was a, it was a really mixed emotions with the comment that I got. Also on top of all the hormonal experiences I was having of being in love with Brad Pitt. It was just, it was a very, very overwhelming time. <laughs>